times. A lot. Yeah, we doing the games. Are we done? We're out of ads. Okay. Hi. Hello. It's hot. We just got home. Heat index 98. Not too bad. Not bad. Compared to the last week. Okay. When is the 17th? What is the 17th of June? A Monday. So I've got a game key to try. I'm not doing it on Monday because it's my day off. Um, but maybe we'll do it on Sunday. I think it could be a fun game. Maybe. I can't decide if I want to make that more narrow or not. Oh. What I could do. Go in here. Uh, properties. Let's make it like a thousand by and then transform to a screen. Then fresh cash. Okay, so they should make it so it's just like in the middle half of the screen. I think that that's better, right? Than having it like full width, but also like. Ooh, there you go. Landed. So, um, we updated, you did it, you did, updated, uh, some mods on the server today that were out of date and added another one called Workbench Expansion, which lets you copy chiseled blocks. And I also increased spawn chances of salmon. I feel like I understand now why game devs have like weird patch notes. Increased salmon spawn. I have. So now there should be plenty more fish in the sea. Hi, Ollie. And by plenty more, I mean like, not like a lot, but like I changed it from a 0.01% to a 0.1. I don't know if it's percent or whatever, but I went magnitude up. Okay, Let's see if it, it lets me do this. Come on now. But yes, in increased salmon spawn, but not in a weird way. Added a mod for copying chisel blocks. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Is the time going weird? I 
I think time's been weird. I don't know. Maybe it's just because it's stormy. So I, I increased, I, I improved cow fire a little, still need some work, but you know, they've got some shelter now. Um, so <sighs> yesterday we made a bunch of syrup. Um, and planted finally planted a garden but i don't know if i've got enough light in here bro I, I I am curious if this is a lighting issue. Ba -ba. I don't see any fishies. Okay. All right. So I need skylights. Yeah, I, I tweak some settings to, to increase fish spawn because I really, really, really want fish in my cave. So I tweaked the settings so that they spawn at a wider temperature range. Um, and... Hi, Luna. Um, I don't know. I don't know if it'll work. But yeah, high temperature range and they're not worried about light. Oh, no, that would be enough to make me cry. How how is your 
your crochet project camera along Luna and how are your hands? Yeah, I'm I'm getting there. I'm definitely getting there. Oh good. That sounds lovely. Um Isn't it pretty? Okay, vintage story. And on underground farming. I'm pretty sure I have it on already. Um let's see. Let's just try this. Poor Abe. Abe's just wanting to play and I'm just like, uh, sorry, I need to reset the server. Uh, sorry, need, need to reset the server. Oh, okay. Ape's like, hi! You're right, thank you. I feel mean. You're like, I just want to play, and I've made you leave twice. I'm sorry. It, it said it's on, but I just did the command anyway. So. Because the last time I had that problem... It was when I was at the edge of the world and things just didn't grow in the last block around the edge of the world. So... Hi, Superman! Okay. Thank you, Superman. By the way, your skill, Superman, with eyeshadow is amazing fucking love it i keep on forgetting to tell you you look fabulous every time i see your stream you just look fantastic i can't do good makeup like that okay it's up i still love that the server takes less than a minute to boot You ever get these moments where your skin just... My hair is just making my skin feel so fucking itchy right now. Oh, look at the fall colors! Like, right now, my my hair is like... It feels like fucking sandpaper. I'm just gonna go check my garden. And then I'm going to find a hair clip. No, that didn't fix it. I think I just... I think it still needs light. Because... Only a few blocks have grown grass. Road speed 97%. I know! That's that's something that's like driving me fucking nuts. It's like, look, am I is it perimenopause or if I am I just fit and unhealthy? Or am I like overweight and unhealthy because of perimenopause? That's not true. I I know I'm definitely a contributing factor. But like that's part of it too. Like itchy scalp that's a part of it like i swear perimenopause if you're on threads 
per the perimenopause threads is so informative but now i just think everything is because of hormones yeah that's what i thought i eh? but yeah wait is it that, that's still showing as a minus i can't everything's stuck on stage one I mean, I was gonna try and punch a, a skylight up there anyway. Because I was curious if the berries were gonna grow in the dark eye there. Oh, wait. What is this? I was like, what is, is this water salt water? I don't think this water is salt water. No, it's not salt water. I was like, God, wouldn't that be the fucking way? I mean, I don't... No, it's definitely not salt water. Oh, good call. Yeah, I don't... I don't know. My my black currant bushes are progressing in less light. I think. Yeah, the, and my black currant bushes are definitely progressing. <sighs> and They're in high fertility soil. You know what? I'm just going to get some other sa other spots. Pop them down in random places. My my garden is being rebellious. Okay, I'm gonna take that. We're gonna plant some random turnips. Like my oak tree's growing. But yeah, last time I had this problem with the the backwards number counting, it was because I was right at the edge of the world. Oh, actually, that was a really dumb place to put it. All right, we're trying those in different locations. Is that still? I can't fucking read. That's. Yeah, minus, minus hours. Oh god. Huh? Stop it. Okay, there we go. I mean, I wanted, I wanted to, to put a. a light well in here anyway. So... Oh, I guess I need to eat.
I I know. I know. I'm hungry. Dirt, 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 dirt. I almost wonder with the fish, like, I don't know how it decides if there's fish. Wait, no, that was a bubble. I was like, I almost wonder if there's like basically a, a timer per block that checks for conditions or something. I don't know. I'm just making sure that. This is a terrible idea. Look, if I can jump up two blocks, then you should let me do letters every other block. I mean, I can replant everything, but I don't know, maybe I did something wrong. I have no idea how high I need to go here. Well, hello, Tin. Yeah. Oh, my hair. Yeah. Right. Can I do this? Let's well, stay if I do this. Stay. Okay. I tried having my hair in a bun before, and it was just like. Too much. It was too tight. So. There. I'm a <laughs> it's fine. <sighs> Those are the only- these are the only ones I have that like Stay in my hair. <laughs> oh, wait. Ah. oh, also, now it's like it's not tight enough, and I can feel the weight of the, my braids on my ear, on my ears. <gasps> okay, I can do this. I just, I don't want... I'm 
see how that goes. I can still kind of feel it pushing my ears though, which is a bit uncomfy. I just want to cut all my hair off right now. I, I'm PMSE and my hair is pissing me off and I'm about ready to just pull it all, <laughs> pull it all out. Like that, that's fine right there. That's fine. Fucking stupid here. All right. We'll see. I don't know how well that's gonna last. Thanks. I need Hey, you know what? That's fine. Following sweet with salty or acid is amazing anyway. I feel like this is an exercise in futility, but I've started now. Yeah, it's good. Also, pickles are amazing for heartburn. Which seems counterintuitive, but they really are. Well, I know I can dig all the way up. But I'm not sure if it's going to do what I want it to do. So on Sunday, we're going to look at a game called... Clothing Store Simulator. So I don't know how many of you have seen Wait, what? Oh, uh, how many of you saw the supermarket sim? It's kind of like that, but with a clothing store. Ow! Um, but you can design your own clothes in it. Okay, I reached the top. I did. My... I, I thought it was going to take longer, actually. Um, so yeah, clothing store Sam. Excuse me. Um, looks quite entertaining. Or it's under due to heat. No, that's fair. I don't know if that's going to bring light in. It looks like it is, right? I guess I'll find it once it gets dark. Um. So yeah, clothing store sim we're doing on Sunday. The uh, the devs gave me a key. Devs are the publisher, but I don't know. Uh, but it looks like it could be kind of fun, and I I don't know, but maybe I can like recreate some shop merch, like in the game. 
Oh, hang on. Did we get a change here? Oh! Those went to stage two. Those just went to stage two by themselves. Ah. So... I mean... I guess I can just dig some more holes. <laughs> I guess and then just put glass at the top so I don't fall in well I mean I can't fall in because I've got ladders yeah that's on a po well one of them is on a positive timer but I don't I don't understand This game is wonky, but I love it, but it's wonky. Oh, also, I just realized. Don't think. I don't think I need a lantern anymore. If, um, 15? Oh, look. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, look, there's some more have gone to stage two. And so is that one. Okay, so that, it's got to be the light thing. A bunch, hmm. It was that. Was that from the lantern? Or... The... I guess we're doing a whole lot of digging today, huh? And so light has got to be the thing. For them to suddenly pop to to tier two, stage two. Thank you, Abe. I guess I need to go make a bunch more pickaxes. I'm I'm really loving this little garden area here. Hello, Molly. Hi. Well, the good news is I needed more things. I want to shave off all of my hair.
Not everything needs to be super. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Sometimes you can just, you know. Well, everyone's got their own style of, of creativity as well. Eh? I'm just, uh, I don't know. What, what? Flynn just called and says I'm a hippie. I'm like, I don't want to, I don't want to disturb the, the contours of the land, man. I just want to work with the floor or something. Oh, Flinter. I told him about that last night and he just gave me like the most wicked side eye. Like, what? Oh, hey, Apprentice, you, you want to terraform? You fucking terraform. Have it. I I stopped doing that because then I would end up with boxes. So like using the contours of whatever I find encourages me to to try do things. I was like because you shouldn't press the lock. I was like, by the way, Ali knows your full name now and he's like, what? And then I repeated it and he's like Okay, and I'm like, it's like Rumpelstiltskin. Ali now has power of you, and he's like, okay. He doesn't appreciate the power you have. What am I doing? Oh, more pickaxes. I, though to be fair, a lot of the conversations that Ali and I have that I relate to Flint, he's like, y'all are weird. Hi, transient. The cretin. Yeah, yeah, listen, Flintrick G3, Alabasta Smith the fourth. He just doesn't he just doesn't get it. Wait till I tell his dad. I'm like, you realize that means that you're Flintry Jeffrey Alabaster Smith the third. And his dad will be like, sure, honey. His his dad's about as Mississippi as you can get. He just smiles and nods. And he puts up with my my liberal my bleeding heart liberal democratic gay rights person he does a very good job of putting up with me actually because i'll like give him i'll give him the stink eye um what am i doing yeah Wait, no, give that back. All right, so we want 180. He's just jealous. Wait. So because of the skills that I put into the smithing stuff, I have to like basically make an extra ingot every time so that I don't waste material. Shit. 
shit. Here again. Why can't I eat a pine cone? Pine seeds are a thing. Big chili mac. Hi. So I I was like blown away. I learned a thing today about this game and then I was like, oh yeah. I know. And I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> well, fine then. Apparently the way that these quirns work is it like cues actions based on how many sides are available. So it'll try and output to side like B and if it can't, it'll cycle again and then try and output to side C and try again and then try and output to side D, etc, etc. So if you have it enclosed on three sides, it goes slower. It's less efficient. And I was like, well, fuck, because I love having them like tucked away in little corners. And now. <sighs> now I'm going to have to figure out a different way. Right. Isn't that interesting, Apprentice? I was I was like. Someone was talking about. Um the most efficient build because I made this like big wind wheel set up with shoots and stuff. And someone's like, yeah, no, that's not very efficient. You need to have it open on all sides to be most efficient. And I was like, what? <laughs> what? Um, so yeah. You saw Molly's pizza again and it made that was a really good like Oh, man, those tomatoes look so good. I love cherry tomatoes. Look, I got distracted. Mm -hmm. Yes, I I am con like I am constantly learning with this game. But it wasn't it was like an interesting thing because I mean Ape explained to me how it worked a lot better than the, the Reddit post, which I appreciated. It's very interesting. I I really think that lighting did make a difference. So where where is it here? Right above this block, right? Here. Here. Oh, I left the charcoal in the fire. I really want my oak trees to get bigger. I do like that every time I play, I learn something different, like that you can use glass blocks and a, a charcoal kiln. So you can see if the charcoal's done. Oh, whoops. Oh, yeah, I came in here because I'm hungry. Um. Also, found out that I can make eight portions of food at once. which is pretty handy. So I guess I should do that. Let 
like i don't want to put any more points in because eight portions at once is two crops always always be learning and and if you're not learning always be crouching or so a, a, a wise woman once told me some yeah i mean unless that's how you like to play apprentice in which case do the scavenge. Do whatever makes you feel good. Alright, so one, two, three, four, five, six. Six blocks. Okay, so one one of those is actually putting out a fair amount of light. One, two, three, four. If I do one light well every, like with four blocks in between, like so every six blocks, I think that'll cover the light. The cover it, right? One, two, three. So like there. And two, oh Christ. And two, three, four, here. Oh, well, that's going to make a mess, isn't it? Bonuses, this is gonna give me a bunch of granite stone, which I'm constantly running out of. I'm, I think that'll work. So now we know the secrets of efficient windmills. Nothing can hold us back. Well, except distractions. Oh, actually, I'm going to leave that there. Um. <laughs> I have the oops, squirrel. Oh, the timer on these has restarted. Honestly, I'm fine doing little light wells. I kind of expect that I would need to. One, two, three, four. So the air, right? This would where that be where that, that scaffolding mod comes in handy. <laughs> That's amazing. Though it looks like the scaffolding is expen quite, quite expensive. But 
I just, it's so weird how like that one's fine, but that one's not. Um, I don't want to leave the letters in there. So I think we gotta go back up and then what a Oh cooking <laughs> What my bad I just gotta level up in cooking I'm like why did that happen? Because I just did some cooking. What was that about squirrels? Uh, that is from primitive, no, no, expanded foods, culinary artillery. It has a really good sound effect, listen. Oh. oh. I love it. Is that cauldron? The only thing you can hear is your Jesus Christ. What are you doing? Why are your legs breaking? Have you considered stopping? Like just like not breaking your legs? I know it's weird and I don't want to backseat your gaming experience. Oh man, that is that is a sound effect. Like if, if you if that's your thing and you just want to scavenge and and break your legs falling in holes, don't let me stop you from that experience. All right, so let's um, I'm gonna go back up here. gonna plug the top of this whoops oh actually I can do the same thing I can dig down some of them are growing yeah the ones in like a four or five block radius of the the light well are growing but the others are still on a negative timer so I'm just gonna do a little grid of light wells and cap them with uh with a, a glass block. One, two, three, four, so here. Yeah, I just said I don't I don't know. Like I remember Drax having to argue with it on the Christmas server. With the the sunlight thing. So I don't know, maybe it's just not applied properly in here or something. But I I mean I it confirmed, like I looked in the video of the server settings. Um, and then, and it did say that underground farming was on. And then when I did that, the config command in chat, it can, was like, yes, it's it's true. You, you know, it was like, world config allow underground farming true or something. And it said that it applied, so. 
I don't know. But, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I did something wrong or not. But, it is inspiring creativity. If by creativity you mean digging a straight vertical shaft down, which you never do. This is how you fall into lava when you play Minecraft. Ow. Look, another one just started popping. Oh, we have ads popping in 30 seconds-ish, maybe, kind of? Yes, now, oh, now. We have ads right now. Yeah, I use, um... I use the stone paths because you can add water to them, but you don't have to worry about like falling through. So they're still functional as a block, as a path block. Well, Something's still not quite right. But it's improving. Look, here's another one popping up now. Oh, look, and now there's more over here. <sighs> All right. I guess that's what I need to do then. Just... We're playing Diggy Diggy Hole today. Raining party! Wine, human. Soma's here. Now we're in trouble. Wine, thank you for the raid. Wow, it is it is much, much brighter in here now. Hello, yes, welcome readers. <laughs> I'm just like sass. Instant sass. Um suddenly resident manners. Yeah. I I hope you had fun. Welcome in everyone who came over uh, with wine. And and also welcome wine. I'm so good at the streaming thing. Um I, I I know how to operate this body, honest. Um you started to rapidly lose words, oh boy. Good news is I didn't have very good wording uh to start off with today, so there won't be too much of a change in case we You tried sick oh my gosh. That's a lot, Wayne. How do you even keep that straight in your head? Well, I guess you didn't, which is why you've run out of words. And two, three, four, here. You used all your brain juice. Well, if you need, if you need to go and like, uh, defrag and soothe your brain from from the wedding 
please, please do a self care. I appreciate your read very much. Uh, and also welcome in for those of you who don't know me. I'm I'm Deliria. My pronouns are she her, and today we're playing D D O. D frag, yes. You know where you like get all the the little blue squares and the red squares all put together where they're supposed to be again and the yellows and the pinks i don't know i feel like it's such a valuable term i remember being so pleased with myself that i would like <laughs> <you're all> <laughs> um that i would like really defrag yeah my computer i thought i was so cool i mean i was obviously but Imagine, right? It took me so long to stop looking for for that function. It's like, oh, my computer's running slow. Do I need to defragment my hard drive? <laughs> Good job, wine. Sounds like you need a cup of tea. Oh, God. One, two, three, four, here. Oh, that one? Like, oh, my, 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 shame. Yeah. Like, what does that even mean? Exactly, like, Unless it's like some sort of alteration of doing like a, a X, but like, like I know that from New Zealand, so it's obviously like a, a thing that's traveled across countries. But it's definitely an aging thing, and it's probably something awful. Okay, someone needs to uh, to to hit hit the Google machine, and and let the rest of us old fuddy duddies know what that is. Please. Oh, jeez! You know what I just realized, Ali? I could have just used a ribbon <sighs> instead of the hair clips, and it would have been more firm. My hair. It's such a. I hadn't even thought about that gesture in like the longest time. One, two, three, four. Yeah, I was trying to think of. My hair is just like irritating me so much today. But I couldn't have it tight against my scalp. All right. D D hole. Oh, I have this massive bag of like polka dot ribbons. They're really adorable. But I was like, if I'd put ribbons in my braids, then I could literally just like tie them up. I've done that before. I'll get like one of my big darning needles. One of the ones, you know, with the big eye and thread the ribbon through and I'll just like sew it into my braid. And then wrap it around and tie it. It's probably not, you know, great, but. It's, oh, okay, wine. That's interesting. 
Your home, his doors, apprentice, you're such a bragger. Good job. Apprentice is like, I have doors now. Oh, 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 my cabbage. My cabbage be sprouting. Back to grunting. Hi, Molly. All right, th this is this has got to be it then. So we still have a negative timer on some stuff. So I guess we just keep going. My cabbages! My cabbages be sprouting. Right, one, two, three, four. Whoops. Right, one, two, three, four. Here. This grid is completely arbitrary. One, two. Okay, I was worried I'd have to dig through my stalagmites, and I love my cabbages, but I... I don't want to ruin my stalagmites. Cabbage! And... Okay, so this one's complete, right? So pretty. So we're basically going to have a grid here. One, two, three, four, here. One, here. Here. All right. I hope that helps. Like, it, it seems, it seems to be helping. Oh, oh, something was in growth stage three. We, we getting fancy. All right. <laughs> I feel like it, it's got to be some sort of permutation of like the evil eye gesture, which is another one of those that isn't necessarily a Judeo Christian symbol. It's just the, you know, like crossing your fingers or something like that. curious well sounds like someone's got a linguistic thesis coming up one two three four here when Two, three. Three. 
three, four, here. Thank. Okay. One, two, three, four. I really want I like the idea of uh that Molly has with the glowy eyes. One, two, three, four. Okay, my grid is accurate. Okay, I guess I'm doing this one now. Um, I don't know. But that's okay. I mean, also, for not paying attention. Why did that not just get immediately blocked, though? Because that's got a URL. Oh, because I don't have URLs blocked. Shut up, Jal. <laughs> Wait till you see some of the faces that Soma does. Those melty eyeballs are something else. imagine trying to play this with controller but that's just because my brain isn't wired that way but I'm sure you could like remap your controller to certain keys in this maybe I should probably get a bandage at some point. For that last little plummet. Alright, so now, now we know. Now we have done an experiment on lighting. What's curious here is... Hi Shay, how you doing? Welcome in. Like these have zoomed ahead to stage three already. So I wonder if they were still progressing, but kind of not. Well, good. Glad to have you. I'm good, thank you. We are doing an experiment with uh, light. See, now we've got grass growing, which we didn't have before. Are you guys? We 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 doing more, more diggy diggy hole. Jiggy 
Uh, I'm from New Zealand, but I also lived in England for a little while, and I've been in the States for over a, a decade, so it's kind of all over the place. I guess so. I mean, yeah, I mean, New Zealand, England, and, and US aren't really that different, but yeah. They are apprentices. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. Hi, Bear. Different enough that I still get culture shock, though. I will definitely say that. Ahoy. So that's a, that's a lot of eyes. Not if they're wearing glasses. Oh, that's not the button I meant to do. It does make for it makes for quite quite the mix of slang. Especially because my my family are from Manchester. Um <laughs> so are you from the Netherlands? That's awesome. Um yeah, so my 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 family are all from the north. They're all from Manchester. Not like deep dark north, but still pretty north. Uh, and I'm a first generation New Zealander, so I would use these British, these terms of phrase that my grandparents would use at school and they'd be like, huh? So, I've got, yeah. Some of the, some of the shit that I, I don't say because I know, literally no one will understand. Like, if I'm waiting, like a phrase that my granddad used to say um, was don't leave me standing here like is he, is he on a rock bun or something like that <sighs> I don't fucking know but it's still something I say is it pithy or piffy uh ouch it just means like don't leave me hanging but you know, why use less syllables than you need? Yeah. I've never I've never bothered with it, but I guess with this recent spade I probably should. This to make less work. What's interesting is I have I have my channel set so only verified users of a certain age can post. So these are these are accounts that have been hijacked. <laughs> And this, that, that's gross that they're using masked links as well. But yeah, I think maybe we'll just... Well, that was interesting. I just I just looked at Stream Elements and I had like a bunch of accounts listed as moderator on Stream Elements. That you know, if you're a streamer and you use Stream Elements, 
go check to make sure because apparently I had some mods on there that I haven't had in chat for a while. Yeah. Oh yeah, no, I know that. But I just really just figured it was a good thing to check while I was there. Okay, so I've just set it to automatically. It's additive, right? So uh, anyone from VIP and up. Should be okay. If I do it like that. Um, it'll just, it should just eat the message. Eateth the message if. Um, so I've just made it so that follow followers are unable to post links, just VIPs in up. Which isn't a terrible thing, it's just that I've really needed it. But by the same token, I don't want to have to be sitting there arguing with spam bot. So should just delete the message automatically now. Oh, here we go. I am very confused as to why So, I have underground farming turned on on my survey, on my server, but my plants weren't growing uh, at all. So I'm digging, I don't know, skylights, sunroofs, light wells. What is this? Oh, I just got the email about that um, gigantify emote thing. Holes to the sky. Hi, Dost. Viewers can I use power ups during your streams? Okay. So yeah, I'm now just digging holes to let light down. And uh, it's making a difference, but it's weird because the whole point of underground farming is, you know, you're underground. Or I don't know. But that's okay. I just wanted to get my flax growing and I'm starting to panic because summer is Yeah. They I could, but the idea of having these like 100 foot deep light wells entertains me to no end. What? Oh, you know what I should have done? 
is put glass on the bottom and left them open at the top and then I could use them as a source of food because there's lots of rabbits and goats up top. Yeah. I, I'm pretty sure I could just put a bunch of lanterns down there. Honestly, I could just put lanterns in the light wells. I don't know why I'm calling them light wells. Makes it sound fancy, like modern architecture or something. Hey, it's a toast! Oh god. The oh god wasn't because toast joined, by the way. Just, just to make that clear. <laughs> It sounds fancy, right? Alright. And thankfully, they're pretty... <laughs> oh my god! Me! They're pretty, like, unobtrusive. Like, because the, the ceiling... <laughs> ceiling... Uh, because the cave is... Is kind of uneven, I don't really think it's gonna have that much impact. I'm gonna need another... I, um, I had a chandelier that I just, like, threw up in the air somewhere. Um, and then my tree grew? And now... I can't find the chandelier, so it just lives there now. It's fine. Now the tree has eaten the chandelier. Oh, thank you. They were, they were literally just, uh, I was, I was having a moment earlier and I was overheating and they were like, the, these were the hair clips that I had, uh, on, on hand. Um, so they, they did the trick. Um, what was I doing? Oh, making another... I was like, fuck, I'm gonna say it. Oh, can I not? Like, is there a way that I can not say it? And then I was like, no. <laughs> no, I can't. I have to. It's like, well, I set it up. Uh, I'll just, you know, I've got to commit to it now. Um, but yeah, so I I have changed just for for people in chat. I've changed the uh, the settings so anyone below VIP will get a ten second timeout for posting links. Wine, hit, wine is is so pooped that they have been reduced to communicating via eyeballs. I think there may have been wine saying, "I I also see what you did there." Yeah, I I mean it's not something that comes up a lot, except for perhaps on craft streams uh, when we're um sharing patterns so I can I could just change the the settings that allows people to actually type in chat to just the first time to start off with because these are all first time chatters I don't know what I've got it set at right now actually Chat 
this without a verified phone number must have accounts older than a month. It must have followed for more than a week. Hmm. Snorp. Whoopsie. Ah, it's hot. You just finished a twelve hour shift? Oh, jeez. Well, I appreciate that you've uh, you've come in and joined in chat when you've just had a long shift. Usually by the time I've done 12 hours or something, I have no desire to talk to anyone. So when it, well, you are welcome to chill here, Shay. Oh, uh, is it Shay or Shayol? Shayol. Please, please let me know if you have a preferred uh, pronunciation of your name. I I instantly just abbreviate people's names and it's probably not a good habit to get into. Okay, awesome. Thank you. Dreamer brain just goes first syllable. M movie? I don't know why I did that on my nose. This is this is how you record videos. Uh, back in the old days, in the last century, you held the camera up to your nose like this. I, my brain is trying to pass these purification things and I just cannot process how it's working right now. Okay, that one's done. That one's done. I haven't got that one yet. This one. Okay, we took down more. I'm a little worried I'm gonna get stuck here. But I should be okay. Now Twitch is telling me my safety settings aren't good enough. <coughs> Your safety settings aren't good enough, Twitch. Your safety settings were good enough, I wouldn't have to worry about my safety settings.
I think this is the job for not PMS brain cell to deal with at a later time. So it's it's almost uh, a month. Ah. Okay, it's fine. Almost a month until my trip now. Just just over a month, sorry. Just over a month. Are we are we off the negative numbers now? No preview. Um, I'm gonna go spend. Oh, we are kind of almost. Uh, I'm just gonna go spend uh, a month in sunny Ohio. Oh, look, they're growing. Um, visiting friends. I haven't had a. I mean, I don't really do anything particularly strenuous, but I haven't had a vacation in either since I got here, like 15 years ago. Which is fine. Because, you know, everything's fine. Um, but I'm going to be house sitting some friend for some friends. And, uh, oh dear, Apprentice is starving to death. Um, yeah. So, some other friends who live nearby are uh, we doing a, like a road trip. I'm very excited. No, actually, I will be able to stream. Um, for it because my friend who I'm house sitting for is also a streamer, and I have my OBS set in. I use OBS in a in a portable mode already. Um, so I can literally just put it on a thumb drive. Snake do a swim. Yeah, I can just put it on a thumb drive and uh, operate stream from that. That so I don't have to mess with his settings. So I'll probably because um, you know I don't I don't stream Vintage Story that often. So I figured I'll just install that on his computer. Um. But yeah. No, I normally stream like five days a week and I, I have no intention. <laughs> that is a lot of polite cats, Buckma. <laughs> wow. <laughs> what are you trying to say? I don't. You, you, you ought to be careful doing that many polite, polite cats. You might hurt yourself. You wouldn't want to strain your polite cat. <sighs> All right. I, I mean, I do stream Vintage Story quite a lot. <clears throat> On occasion, sometimes. Right back, man? Please, there. Um, so yeah, I'll still be streaming. I might have like a few days off so I can like relax with my friends. Um, but while I'm I'm house sitting and dog sitting, I'll be on my own. I'm so looking forward to this. I haven't been on my own like overnight in. Fuck, I don't know. Yes, two dogs, two corgis that are both complete goofballs. I'll be leaving behind my doggo, but my husband will be taking care of her. Um, but yeah, I've not been like alone by myself overnight for like, I don't know, over a decade. And I'm, I'm a solitary creature, so I'm quite looking forward to break. I love my husband very much. He's like, he's my best friend and we hang out and we have fun and we've been married for like 15 years. But God, I'm looking forward to the time by myself. I'll love him more when I don't see him. <laughs> when, I, when I come back. I'll love him more when I come back. But yeah, so that'll be a nice trip. Because I live in Florida, so it's going to be quite the... Uh, Quite the adventure. Uh, 
I did pick up the other pig, right? I did. God, that would have sucked. Something like that. Well, we started off as a long distance relationship, so that tracks. Oh, this makes me so happy that these things are growing now. Look, stage three, stage four. That's okay, my little cabbages. I don't mind if you're stunted by the heat. So I only have two more to dig. I'm curious at what point this tree is going to get taller because the K-Box and the Ned for environment are really fucking tall. And the same with the oak tree, actually. I'd appreciate it if it just, like, grew up. <laughs> but yes, anyway, so I I do... Uh, since I started playing Vintage Story... Uh, when did I play it? I started playing it last year, the end of last year. And by the time... Twitch sent, sorry, by the time Steam sent its annual roundup. No. By the time Twitch sent its annual roundup of like the games that I played, it was like one of the top games that I'd streamed all year. Not on Steam. Um. And I just keep coming back to it. <laughs> I do play other games sometimes. Occasionally. Oh no, it was it was this one. Here. Here. Um I I don't play I I have played the other block game. Um, a few years ago. Um. But it didn't grab me as much as this one did. But I like sort of open world, sort of exploration. I, I don't know where I'm digging next. Um, but yeah, I love sandbox games, survival, exploration, um, base building, so like Valheim, No Man's Sky, <laughs> <We> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> the other block game, the block game that shall not be named. Jesus Christ, look at all that light coming down here. <laughs> Congratulations, you died! Holy crap! That is bonkers! Okay, so... Did I dig that one? Okay, so it's two north of the westernmost one, right? Yeah. Um... There's, I usually have space in my brain for like one sort of large open world game at a time. So I tend to like pick one and I'll no life it until all I can do is eat, sleep, drink and poop that game and then I'm over it. Um, and then I'll find something else and I'll come back to them. Like Conan Exiles I've played over and over again. Um, in Valheim I played a bunch too. I haven't played properly, I don't think I've played since Miss, before Miss Lands dropped. Um, but I also enjoy things like Assassin's Creed, um, and I play Euro Truck Sim and American Truck Sim. And I, I like doing some sort of indie games too, so we're kind of we, 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 tweaking around a bit. That one's done.
Oh, this one. Alright. One, two, three, four, here. One, two. Oh, God. <sighs> Look, can we not do that, please? All right, one, two, three, four, so here. This is this is ridiculously pretty up here. One of these things I'm gonna do my my tr my orchard up here I think, but I want to come up here in winter and make sure that wherever I decide to plant isn't too cold that I'll actually like kill the trees. But it's absolutely fucking gorgeous up here. This is this the the full color palette in this game just makes me like have wicked cute aggression. But very, I don't know. <laughs> it, I have issues. All right. All right. Let's do this one since I'm right here. Yeah. I'm I, I can get pretty emotional. Especially when things get really pretty. Oh, I have coffee. I'm curious if there's been a noticeable change. It's interesting watching the temperature go up as I get further down. Um, if there's been any noticeable change in fish. That, you know what, we've got a lot of neurospicy people in this channel. Um, the whole, whole range from all over the place on the spectrum. So, <laughs> you'll be, you'll be fine. Yep, absolutely. A hundred percent. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, look. For a mile to volcano, yes. And that's just me, depending on what time of month it is. Oh no, that's a snake. I was like, oh my god, there's a fish! No, it's a snake, right? That's a snake. Right? Right? It is a snake. Why are there so many snakes in here all of a sudden? Game, snakes are not fish. I wanted fish. <laughs> I can't get over how bright it is in here now. Like, this is like the best lit cave ever. <laughs> Apprentice, you're, you can use the accurate quote if you like. But I, I appreciate your restraint. Okay, come on. Uh, all 
Okay, these look like they're all behaving finally. Ooh. Okay, these are already at stage four. Perfect. I, I'm honestly, I cannot get over how bright this is because outwardly it's not really had much impact on the appearance of the cave. But that's, that's really bright. <laughs> oh, Luna. Cute picture of Cato. Well, I have one left. I can't leave it incomplete. Look at the crap. Crap. His name is Kona. Like the coffee bean? Or Hawaii, I guess. I'm so excited my garden is growing. Okay. Oh, shit. All right, last one. I I made the back was just like going cruisy there. I made it a little bit more narrow. Instead of having it over the full screen, I made it a thousand wide and then it's just in the middle. So we're going to get a little bit of ricochet. But am I not turtly enough for the turtle? <gasps> Echo. Thank you. Really? Um, is it this, this one? Um, but yeah, so that, that, I think that's kind of like a good blend between having like the narrow window with the fucking ricochet rabbit bullshit and then the one that takes for two. Or two. Hey! Okay. Hi, Echo. Good, good luck. I'm excited about your phone call. It's okay. I am working on providing light so my my plants can photosynthesize because they were sad. And I just kind of realized that it's just like a little over a month before uh, my trip to Ohio. You've been getting a lot of stuff done though that would be really difficult to do if you had a job. But yeah, the, the lack of income would drive me. Like, it, it's rough. But yeah, some of those jobs, those big jobs you've been doing would be rough. Especially if you were doing the the job like your last one, that custodial work on top of everything else, you'd be fucking wiped out. Ah? Okay. Alright, light wells complete. I had to dig massive holes through the mountain to let light down for my garden because things weren't growing. Which is just fucking rude. I think... I'm just gonna leave that there.
Now I need the bucket. But yeah, all of my plants were like stuck at stage one. <laughs> Now that growing. All right, we have ads popping in 30 seconds. As I didn't take a break last time, I'm going to this time. Um, so I will be going AFK for a couple of minutes to stand up and stretch and have a wee and get a drink. Uh, I should all do that too. Apparently it's good for you or something. Oh. Um. All right, let me just get to a cute place. Crap, bed not come at me. All right, I'll see you in a few minutes.
Well, hey, I didn't realize. I was just looking at my chat log. I didn't realize that Molly and Wayne had both done a gigantify and emote thing. Heck. Other than it popping up in my in my activity feed, there was no indication to me that that had happened. No, so Molly, Molly and Wine both did did an emote thing and made it big, but I didn't see it. So. Like, no... Now I feel mean. Anyway, I've done- I've- I've increased everything in price, because we can't disable it. But thank you, Molly. Thank you, Wine. I appreciate the biddies. Oh, and the Della Celebration, too. Oh, okay. And the Celebration. I wonder if there's going to be a like a hook for it and stream about. So that you can actually hear when it happens. Chuck, I'll get. Look at you go. Alright, I think these are will be okay now. I guess we'll find out. Um, I, I don't know. Unless there's some, like, I don't know. I, I, I don't know. <laughs> No, but I want to know now. Uh, string trimmer. Weed whacker? I don't know what part of the world you're from, Shay. I, I quietly, I want to say like Aussie, but I could be wrong. Please don't hate me. Nether oh, you said Netherlands. Fuck's sake. Stream of rain. I'm sorry. I'll remember next time. I don't. I don't know the regional phrases for the. Literally said like an hour ago that you were from the Netherlands. Okay. So that's done. That's right. I, I guess it's just a string trimmer. Yeah, I think Weed Eater may have been a brand, you know, like Xerox, but copying. Um. Weed Whacker? Yeah, that's one that I've heard before. Perfect. Crabby, crabby, crap, crap. Oh no. 
Forever you stuck? Ah. Why pinch me? Deprived of light might die soon. Ah. These things hit hard, man. Oh, I think it's dead. We shall dine well on crab tonight. Just keep stabbing it. <laughs> Eventually it'll turn into crab nuggets. Sounds fucking terrible. Oh no, I fucking did it again. Uh, yeah, this is uh, from Primitive Survival. Um, but these are the mods that we have installed. Plus, plus uh, one that I installed today that I can't remember the name of. Expanded workbench. Thank you, Abe. Uh, but yeah, the crab is from Primitive Survival, and it's a really interesting mod. It adds a lot to the game, but in a way that I feel like fits with how it, it kind of fits within the theme of the game. Like, it doesn't add electricity or or anything like that, which isn't which isn't to say that that's not like that's not bad because whatever you want to do, you do it. Um, but it it fits the theme, I think, is the word I'm trying to use. I can word real good. Okay. Um, <laughs> look, wording, wording is so overrated. What? Level 10. I'm always really impressed when people can switch. You're fluid and bullshit too? Me too. I feel like all streamers are pretty fluent and bullshit. <clears throat> it's a very valuable life skill. <gasps> We're gonna have a baby. No, but... But it's a skill that a lot of streamers have to develop as well. Uh, cows come from the medieval expansion. Um, I will say, as, as part of the, the the medieval expansion, the cows are really neat. Um, however, 
the native spawn rate or the the natural spawn rate of cows from this expansion is too high and there's literally cows fucking everywhere but well, there could be cows fucking everywhere i haven't seen it but there's a lot of cows um so i had to install a mod to configure spawn rates um and like knock it back a lot yeah i mean if there's a lot of cows they probably are fucking you know because you know they will conquer the world it's a catastrophe it, w it would explain why they're everywhere um but yeah we 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 dialed it way back they're gonna conquer the world very good i you know Eka, i really feel like there was just like milking it Nope, nope. Really? Really stream elements? Okay, so now we have... Okay, my hair clips are starting to piss me off now. I can feel them just like Pulling just like a single strand of hair. See how this goes. It might be okay now I'm not as hot as I was before. Okay, so next thing is I need flat. <laughs> thanks thanks Ali appreciate it I am I am so glad that I have friends to help keep track of these things oh I was like what is the context on that one especially because it's in a craft game Like I was, I was in craft stream. Maybe, maybe zombies or, or Sims. Cause we did a few streams where we had like Sims and Zed. Context. Context, context. That's. Decorating with death. I, I feel like it was that. It was either like Sims or. Yeah, or maybe Project Zomboid or maybe Conan Exiles. Perhaps. My, my hair is seriously, I just want to go cut it all off right now. Cut it all off! Okay, well while I wait for... I mentioned it to Flint the other day. It's like it's so hot, and especially now we've got the pole. The the temptation, just because I don't want to have my hair wet all the time if I'm using the swimming pool. It's like I could just cut it all off. And he's like, You could. Yeah, that's the thing. He's like, I you could, but the whole time you had like when I had my hair cut short last year, he's like, 
the whole time you had your hair short you complained about missing the length and I was like fuck you're right <laughs> So, like I definitely feel more me with long hair but then I've had long hair since I was like 15 that, the, when I had it cut last year it's the shortest I've had it since I was 15 and it was really cute like it, it got really curly but god I missed it yeah basically Echo well, no, he wouldn't, because he'd just tune it out. He's pretty good at that. So we could do with some hunting. I just realized, because I've got, like, no fat for storage. Maybe we need to go on like a hunting gathering trip. It's been a while since we did one of those. I probably don't need a bucket for that. Oh, I've got to put barrels in here. This pantry is not very efficient. All right, what am I going to cook with it? There. That, that's from uh, Bricklayers. They have like a bunch of colors. And that's uh, where these are from as well, these floor tiles. Really cute. I haven't figured out how to make them myself yet. But they are very cute. Once I get the, um... Once I get the windmill going, and I can get a hell of hammer, I think we'll be good. Wait, wait! I can't make a crab meat stew? Is that what that's telling me? It's, it's honestly, it's so... Modding in this is so easy. Interesting. Doesn't want to let me do that. Um, yeah, no, the modding in this, they've done a really good job of making it um, easy. So... <laughs> I mean... Yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah, so once you go, when you go to the website, I don't know if you're asking for help, but I'm going to give it anyway because it's what I do. Um, when you go to their website, uh, there's like a one click install button on next to e on the, each mods page. And if you click that, the first time you do it, it'll ask if you want to uh, launch the game or launch the game by default and it will launch the game and it'll just install the mod where it's supposed to go and that's all you need to do like it's super easy Well, 
Molly, thank you for the the new redemption thingies. I didn't I didn't know that you did it. I didn't hear anything. It is seriously the easiest game to add mods like ever. Genuinely easy. So there are some that have like dependencies where you like you might have to make sure that you have one thing for another, but they're always really clear. Um, but I will happily uh, like if you would like some help, I will happily show you how it works, or I can answer questions, or someone else can chat can answer questions. I don't know what to do with my crab meat. So I'm gonna make crab nuggets. Oh, I just had a thought. Can I? Oh yeah, 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 definitely. Uh, here. <clears throat> um, this ch this channel here. This is a YouTube channel with really great guys. Everything's short and succinct tells you what you need to know and there's no like I found this out after I went climbing in the mountains of Bolivia and then I got this cure for an ingrown toenail uh etc 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 it's literally like this is how you do the thing big recommend if you have time uh if nothing else like bookmark bookmark his channel and uh, check out his guides We've, we've got a few people in here who are pretty into the game now. Yeah, not not tonight. That's what I mean. Oh, it's really late for you. <laughs> but yeah, it's uh, definitely a, a, a handy, a handy dandy resource. I still use, I still have a couple of videos that I use of his. <coughs> Can I do this? No, I s- why? <laughs> Never! Okay, honeybee, question. Why can't I cook with the crab nuggets? I was so excited. Thanks, Chip Roman. I need more crab? But I have four crab nuggets. Oh, no, yes, you're right. Thank you. I knew that. I was just testing. I don't know how to do that. I I don't have any rice. That's okay. I can use up some of my my odd little bits here. Crab, cabbage, and mushroom. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not, fe I feel like that is going to be really fucking stinky. Some of the combinations are okay, but the crab and the cabbage. What I want is a spreadsheet of recipes. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Like a spreadsheet of of all the recipes that you can make from expanded foods. I mean, it could be, but that's not not going to negate the combination of. Oh. 
not gonna get cabbage fire. I, I feel like fishy cabbage fart's not going to be a pleasant experience. I do love cabbage. Cabbage is delicious. I hated it when I was younger and now I'm just like, fuck yes, cabbage! Try an old person. Boiled cabbage is gonna make you fart. I don't. I don't know. Maybe. I. I don't know. Maybe it's just a thing. But I don't know anyone who has boiled cabbage and doesn't get the farts afterwards. It's just how it goes. All right. Oh, I ate more of that than I thought I did. I love when you hold hot food that it like steams in your hand. All right, I don't need the hoe with me. Put that away. Hmm. Oh, isn't it? It's it's really neat when that happens. Yes. Hammer mold, shovel. Oh, that's what I meant to get. Um, I don't need another pro pack. Just before I go, yeah, it's super pretty. I can see that. I get, I get like cute aggression with this game. Where I'm just like, how how dare it be as pretty as it is? Sixty. <laughs> Look, I can't help it. It's just so pretty. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> you, you're not wrong. But like, look at it. It is pretty. Hello, cows. <laughs> yeah, good. Look, see, and now we're getting autumn colors coming in. So you're going to start hearing hearing me get bitey at the game more. You know what? Maybe I need one of those um, silicon Lego brick necklaces to like bite on when I'm feeling overwhelmed. Yeah, that's behaving a lot better now. These aren't progressing. I'm wondering if I need to do a light well for the berries as well. Can't tell. That's not urgent though. Oh, I just 
then walked away from it again. No, my hair is still bothering me. Ugh. Oh, I don't need that either. Okay, what I am going to take is a stack of clay. We're going to do an explore. I've got all, all this copper roofing. I really want this tree to just like fucking grow up. Let's <laughs> grow up. So let's go check the resin. My redwood tree grew. I planted it in a dumb place, but it grew. That's cured, right? Yeah, it has. Oh no! I did. I did something similar, but instead of burning. The whole base to the ground i burned myself to the ground i uh i went to bed with a torch in my hand and it, apparently that's not a good thing to do when your house is full of flammable things so i, I woke up on fire oh hi hello <coughs> It's a Drex. Yeah. So that was a lesson learned. Uh, don't fall asleep on flammable things when you're holding an open flame. Which is, you know, weird. I know. How bizarre. Yeah. So how was... Um... Airborne steampunk game, I, whose name I can't remember, that I saw you were playing. Oh, really? Because they offered me a key and I was just like, I don't know if I can. Fucking Soma. Oh my god, how bright is this? Been right? How dare. It's so chill. I think um I they they emailed me and offered me a or mentioned the like a, a sneak peek demo or something. Um and I was like, look, I I don't have the mental bandwidth to be able to to give your game the benefit of my full energy right now. I think basically I said something like that and they were like, we'll, okay, we'll come back to you when we're, you know, like we'll email you again later on. And I was like, that would be awesome. Thank you. I'm trying to get better about like polite no thank yous and but keeping it open. Excellent. Hey, it was lovely to meet you, Shay. Have a wonderful sleep. Um, I look forward to seeing you again soon. <clears throat> so they're they're pretty good. Like I worked with them um for Wandering Village. But yeah, I was just like, look, I, I could do it now, but my brain is basically like not firing on all cylinders, so I won't 
you know, you you deserve the the full benefit of me, and I don't have that right now. So, man, we had to do uh, we had to to dig out some massive light wells for my garden to grow. It was it was so dark that everything was on a negative timer even though we have underground farming on and it did it like instantly worked well you see how bright it is in here i don't have my lantern on um so basically every uh you have a four four block um, and yeah, as soon as I got that in, got the first one in, they started growing again. But like, what's the point of underground farming if you have to keep on adding, like, I could have used synthetic light, but, or I could just dig a big hole in the ground. And who doesn't want to just make a dig, a bigger dig hole? We've we've done a lot of digging. Dig a dig. No, no, <laughs> no. Okay. Uh, but yeah, as soon as I, as soon as I did that, uh, it everything started growing. I'm just gonna shut up now. Listen. I don't, I don't know. I've got nothing. <laughs> like, where, where else would you know? Never mind. Nothing. Carry on. Okay, we are going hunting for critters and uh, the foraging in general. I really fucking love this little part of my garden. Hunting and gathering. But where am I going? Which direction? Oh, you know what? We should head out east and then I can get those blueberries. Wording is hard. Um, Sunday we are going to be playing a game called Clothing Store Simulator, which is like the the supermarket one, and I. I wasn't going to, but then I saw you could design your own merch and dress the mannequins in the store, and I was like, I'm fucking in. I'm so in. It launches on Monday. And they wanted me to do content for a Monday. I'm like, that's my day off. I'll do it on Sunday. So I'm intrigued by it. I. 
I don't know how much what I'm gonna get out of it. Like I feel like it's gonna be a lot like Supermarket Sam, but I'm kind of looking forward to the the dressing the mannequins in like the the t-shirt design and stuff. Like you can make your own logos and things. So depending on what the system is, we may have some channel point redemption set up to. Uh... Oh no. Oh, okay, <laughs> I was just like, I see Ali's posting clips. I'm like, oh god, what have I said? <laughs> Thanks, Ali. <laughs> I was like, oh no, what did I do? Um. So yeah, we might we might set up some some channel point redemptions for that, depending on how it it plays out. <laughs> I was just like, wait. There's a message. Wait, it's from Ali. Oh god, what have I done? Fine. Unfiltered Dell, yeah. That was... I think that, w that was definitely... You know when you say something and then you realize afterwards what you've said? Yeah. It's so pretty! Look at all these gold colors starting. It's it's taking Wimdy around here. Ooh, limestone. Uh, you are coming home with me. Hello, blueberries. I have a space already set up for them. Oh, really? 13? I have 14 spaces for blueberry bushes and you've given me 13. <sighs> oh, oh, no, black current. I, you know what? I'm going to leave that there. I should have bought one of the cages. I should have bought the cages with me as well. It's a hurricane, apparently. Man, that wind sound is a lot. Oh, oh, there's a snack. Uh, hello, Mr. Snacky Pants. Oh, it looks like he's smelling the flowers. Oh, you know what? I need I need some of that. Because these things hurt. Oh. Mid Are you too far away? 
two, three, four, five, six, seven. I don't know why I have to count them. So I, I've scaled the cows, the wild cows back as well. Jesus Christ. Again, more. Oh, I should look for the fish since we changed the fish spawns. Fishy, fishy, fishy. No fish. Oh, that was disappointing. So we really wanting like the the meat's fine, but we really want. Theory bushes. Um, bad for preserving food. Oh, this is pretty. Because it's forage. Mm. I've got to a point where I just leave a lot of these intact now. For, for you know, someone else to, to rummage in. I guess I, I kind of need hides too, so. It'll all be put to good use. I will take, check the tools ones. Jimmy, flint crap. All right. I always check the uh the tools ones because you never know. Jesus already? Alright. Fruit tree. Oh, I knew this was a fruit tree. Apple tree. Oh, trader. Unmarked trader. Hello? You can sell. Oh, I was like, limestone? No, never mind. Arsnip blue cheese. Eh. The farming book might be nice, but at least ninety five percent durability. Damn, they saw me coming. 
Alright. Yeah, yeah, you too. I hear bees. I think I need to get into a proper forest for hunting. Rather than the redwoods. Hey! Hi, Alpha! Yeah! Thought I'd do something different today. You know? shake things up a little yeah it has I was I was worried I'd forget how to play so I thought I should you know get going for a bit I keep seeing this flint in this biome and it looks like the uh, witch's hat mushrooms almost. Piggy! I was worried then he was going to get too close. Oh, there's a resin tree around here. chickens I know I ought to you know get some critters other than the cows but just it's like uh I, I think that's a specific job you know like go out specifically looking for chickens because you don't want them to suffocate I mean I don't I have no idea where I am now in a, in a cave Oh, it's right there. All right. Uh, we have ads starting in 30 seconds. Uh, so I'm going to stand up and take a break. Uh, you should too. And I will see you in a few minutes. I'm, I'm doing this in case a fox comes out and tries to get me. Dude, just chill. Oh, this is all cool. Okay, there we go. Alright, back soon.
That's close. <laughs> now you're gonna put dirt all over my hot bar. It's like, yeah, I'm cruising. What about it? All right, let's just do a... Mm, south. You didn't land? Oh well. Ooh. Oh, it's so pretty! <sighs> wait, 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 wait. Oh, I have zinc somewhere. I know I had zinc somewhere. Right there. Okay, so there is zinc and it is bismuth. Find your own bismuth. <gasps> Could you polish these blocks and have them in your house? Oh no, we've cornered the raccoon. Actually, I've been finding a lot of bismuth. Oh, dang. And olivine. Honestly, considering how much I was always trying to find olivine on the other server, Thanks, ship Roman. <laughs> Fucking olivine is everywhere on this damn server. Partially eaten. <laughs> Cow. Okay, here's the thing. moved. You've got to get that, that good distance from the cow. That was not the good distance. Let me bro. So that was too close. Still there. I 
I think. Okay. I was waiting for you to jump up and try and fuck me up. Our skins, hats. Oh, where where are you? Here. Is this too close? Seriously, keep on expecting them to be playing chicken. Which is silly, because they're cows. I hear bees. Oh, <gasps> look at the little family of delicious snacky snacks. Oh god, that sound. Where'd they go? 
Look, hunting wolves at night time is really not smart. Well, I guess I live here now. Oh, that wolf sound. But the bees are buzzing and the wolves are wooing. I'm such a wuss. I don't I still don't have any armor. So you know. It's fine. Oh. I saw someone talk about an interesting way of hunting wolves and bigger prey is basically to have them chase you and then dig down a one by one pit and then just like get a, ste a spear and just like stab up. <laughs> and I was like, okay, so it's kind of like the opposite of a nerd pole and that it's like a nerd pit. I said, there's no way they're going to have aggro on me still, right? Yeah, because they can't fit in the hole then. Right? Damn it. I need to stop eating my stones.
Fine, whatever. Yeah, that's a good point, actually. Or that you have, like, a really good pick. So you can, like, get through the, the rock fast. Why? Look. If I can... Energy saver mode on my AC. Oh my god, I'm down to like 28 rocks. And most of them were thrown at the walls. Right. Oh, there was the like the nickel and the zinc. I can't. I can't even mine those yet. If I'm careful about how I use my stones, get four more cows. I can find four more cows. I have iron. I have many iron bloom. I genuinely, I just have to smith it. Oh. Is that far enough away, do we think? Damn it. Well, that's an interesting little ravine. I don't think I want to go down there. Whoa. Well, hi. Hello. What do we reckon? Is this far enough away? I think, was that it? Please? All that, and I've only got seven there. I really need to 
get some farming done. Maybe next trip out we'll come out with the traps. Ooh, this is a pretty place. Five, seven. I literally own, I have exactly seven rocks. Fucking pushing it. Take seven to kill a cow. That thing is terrifying. Oh, it's mud break. I don't even want mud break. Oh, really? Just like from holding the trigger? That's what usually gets me. Yeah, I can get a, a blister from holding the trigger down. The, um, my new weed eater, the balance is slightly different, so I'm hoping that will help. So my old one had the battery at the very top end of the handle, and the one I have now is, uh, the battery is like, kind of sits under where your hand is, so you don't have that have, you're not having to fight that leverage kind of thing going on. But yeah, I, my hands are always sore after using the weed eater. Oops. Yeah, from the, the maintained thing. The, you know, like, I, I understand that the safety is important, you know? You, you don't want to... I, I don't know that really anyone's do. You finished the front? Good, well done. Give yourself a pat on the back. If you can. I can't reach, so I can't, I can't do that for you. Hello. Alright, one more.
I'm able to take what I've got. Yeah. I guess I need to build a smoker. Oh. Freaking olivine, seriously, it's everywhere. So offended. It's just like, how fucking dear. It's like I mined a stack of it just to get it, but now I'm just like, eh. Did I? I don't remember climbing up so high. Oh, well. Yes, never mind. Man, some of these spots are so pretty. Like, Gorgeous. Sunflowers and oh. cat men. What's a bit if I came back here looking for chickens, I wouldn't find any. <laughs> it's fucking cats. Yeah. We've, uh, oh God, that reminds me. We need to. Uh, the our boy cat Squeaky, when he came in last night, was being very, very vocal. Like his tail was high, his ears were straight up, and he was like, "Wow, wow, wow!" And the only time he does that is if he's been hunting, and bought Flint a gift, but we can't find it. There's flies, but we can't find the gift. And it's like, oh, God. He's such a sweet boy, though. Like, he's he's really skittish with everyone, but he loves Flint. Flint is his human. I am a spare. I will be tolerated as a provider of food, but don't touch, which is fine. But like Flint, he lets Flint pick him up. Like hold him on his back and hit him. But yeah, he's he definitely bought bought his dad something as a treat yesterday and really need to go out and find out what it is.
before it gets too nasty. Wow. Big color change. Just can't help themselves. I keep being hopeful that I'll find a trader that wants to just buy like limestone rocks or something. I was like, that's not my cave. No, that's a different cave. I just realized the music stopped. I didn't realize, I don't know how long it's been quiet. my cave. Honestly, it, it, it's kind of tempting just to big light well, dig light wells all throughout their cave. But then I also kind of like that it's a contrast. I like living under a sieve, exactly. Everything looks much better now. Interesting the way that the lighting works. Okay, and smoker, planks, and cobblestone. Where do I want to put that? Can I 
Put the deer. No. There, that's what I wanted. Alright, I still need twine to do this. get skins processed. Oh, whoops. Some of those were there. Oh, I have another barrel. There are another couple of barrels in here, actually. Hey! There's candy in my pantry! And a teapot! Host. <laughs> I've been toasted. <laughs> it's it's like being punked, but delicious. Thank you, toast. It's funny because I ran right past that stuff and then I was like There's things where I don't normally ex expect things Alright, what is Cran- oh, I figured that would be the case Cranberry brandy That's why we've got the teacups Aren't they cute? And black currant syrup. Perfect. This dang game, seriously, if you drink brandy from a porcelain teacup, you get fucking wasted. I don't know if that works IRL. Someone needs to science it. Um. This dang game. Honestly. You're sleepy all of a sudden? Well, you've been busy. Like that that's okay. Toast, so thank you so much for hooking hooking me up with sweet treats and booze. 
Thanks, Superman. no idea what that was in response to, but yeah, that tracks. What's a hard man? some borax already look i i have everything i need to make have a good rest deco i i literally have everything i need to make an iron anvil except the will to manually <laughs> smith in iron ingots I just realized I'm, I mean, not quite, but I was just like, this is basically Fraggle Rock, right? In a massive cave, I've made my home. I, there's no radish sticks and no doozers, but there are crabs. And turnips. Away. Do, do. I, you know what? I love Prager Rock, but I loved the doozers. I had a like a little picture book of of doozers when I was little, and I loved it so much. It showed like all the little doozy kids like going to school. And what the doozy kids were taught at school, like all the engineering and maths, and they were all like geeks, and I loved it. They're all complete nerds. A funny old man and a dog. What was the dog's name? I can't remember the dog's name. Sprocket, yes, that's right. I was, I don't know, I always felt like the junk that the Fraggles were kind of a bit douchey, but I also loved the trash heap.
Oh, the rat? Yeah, the rats were cool too. All right, I need more lime. 14, 36. But yeah, I was just, I don't know, I was sitting there working away in my cave and I'm like, <gasps> Hello? Am I a fraggle? I was always curious about radish sticks and I was so disappointed when I finally tried radishes. In my head, radish sticks were like, like potato sticks, you know, like the really thin, um, like the ones that are like thinner than shoestring fries that you get in a, a bag. I can't remember, I don't know what, if they're called potato sticks here or something else, but but yeah, I thought they were basically like, like the chips. And so when I tried a radish and I was like, this is spicy. No, this isn't right. I like the potato sticks, except they stab you in the mouth. I don't think I've ever been fond of radishes. Should I just stop messing about and make some iron tools? Uh. I should see how much linen I've got. Maybe I could make like a basic windmill. I kind of wish this was a toggle. hands getting tired. Oops. Hey. What? Hey, 
Thank you. You're almost caught up to Ali. Flintrick, if that is your real name. <sighs> okay. All right, now I need to make some twine. I have I have some some fair right Oh, you can just use that too. All right. Uh, all right, so need vines or cattails or papyrus. And since it's just me, I'm gonna go upstairs and have a snooze. Okay, Alpha. All right, we have Ed starting in 30 seconds. Not a good time to stand up, stretch, have a wee. Do, do the things you need to do. And uh, I will also go and do the things I need to do. 
in the end. I'll see you in a few minutes. Hi, Carter. This is still not growing. Oh, but my garden's coming along. These jerks at the end. Not much to do about them. I guess I'll catch up eventually. Oh, right. Uh, reeds. Or oh, papyrus. I don't know if it's papyrus or tall at the end. Probably. But. Hood has had 100 before. So. Uh, in Mel's Discord, here, there's a, a thing about it. No, not on this channel. No one's got a hundred on this channel. I don't know what the top score is on this channel. I can't remember what the commands are. Probably. <laughs> well, 
dropped high is that. <laughs> Sorry, what was that, Carter? I don't think, I don't know why it's not counting those uh, who are recent ones. Maybe you're disqualified. I don't know. I didn't write that. Game's trying to steal your achievement unfollow yeah definitely a good idea unfollow unsubscribe very smart i i genuinely don't know why it's doing that Or I do, and I'm just not saying it. But I would never do that. Did the music just stop again? It did. Oh, it ran out. I, I keep on getting bios remorse about Soundstripe. It's just, I don't know, I feel like there's less variety of music and it's not quite as easy to navigate um, as Epidemic. And even though it's been over a year since I used them last, I still recognize a lot of the tracks. The one thing I do like is that you can specifically exclude holiday music. But it just, like, if you select, I like to know how many tracks are in a playlist. So that you can have an idea if the playlist you've picked is like, gonna be long enough for stream and there's no tr like track numbers on this but that's okay lesson learned for next time i i went with these guys because it was like 20 20 dollars less i budgeted for 100 and that's what i spent but i probably should have just got epidemic again So that said, it's still uh, an immense 
weight off my shoulders not having to worry about licensing but they they also seem to have a much more like eh, sort of laissez-faire um reaction to i've emailed them twice about getting claims on my youtube videos and they're like if it's not basically like if it's not affecting your monetization what's the problem like because it's still a channel and i'm licensed for this music i shouldn't have to be doing uh appealing claims for every single vod i upload to youtube But apparently that's just what it was. It used to be that you could just like manually submit um, your VODs and they'd clear them, but apparently that's now a, an extra feature that you have to pay for. I mean, I still had to argue with, with the epidemic as well. Like, that's not different. It just sounds like attitude is disappointing. All right. Hopefully that doesn't burn the door. It'll be okay. this meat already starting to spoil? Alright, so we've got nine fits. That's enough to seal some cooking pots. Now I'm worried. I don't think I have enough firewood. Making a stew with slightly spoiled meat. It'll be fine. Oh, that was the crab nuggets and uh, crab nuggets and cabbage stew. Yum.
this on lightning. Hmm. Hmm. Excuse me. All right. All right. Oh, my frames. My frames, they are hurting. That should give me some firewood. Did you do it? Did, did you do it? Hi! Hello! Welcome in! I'm like waffling and Ali is like, no, this is how, what you do. Say so welcome, Raiders! 101%! Good job! And a boxing match. Oh, thank you for the raid. Well done on 101 percenting Donkey Kong 64. I know I know nothing about these things. I know nothing. I guess. Oh, uh, it may have gone a little overboard. There is no one hundred percent in this game. There's no such thing. So, no, never. It is a very valid reason to play a game. I hope you enjoyed it and had much fun. Yeah, wow, Carter. Way to, like, kill my buzz. I thought I was just going to be able to, like, get to end game by making boiled turnips. Just ruined it.
Oh, now you think you can just do a drop? It's Adele. Hi, Nadia. Uh, but yeah, welcome in. When you came over with Time Wonder. Hi, I'm Del. Valeria. There is a cooldown, apparently. Is it broken? It's broken. What did you do? <sighs> broken. Okay, have have fun spreading democracy. I believe in you. And thank you for the raid. Okay. It's just gonna sit there with Buckma's name on forever. Hex, yeah. Here we go. There you go. I think there is collision, by the way. <laughs> it's so cute. Oh, maybe not. Maybe it's only when you queue them up that they have collision. Oh god. Well, good effort. Yes. Do I? I don't know if I want. Oh, I get. It's like I don't know if I want to preserve these, but. Made with spoiled me. But honestly, it's still food. I don't know how long it'll last once it's in the air, but it'll do. Turnip and carry. That's that one, Well, we got a good amount of skins going for leather. We got the garden going. We got some light figured out for the garden. Finally. I think I might have to do some more digging for the, uh, the berry bushes. I got lots of berries, but I need to um, get some lice in here. Need some light on the situation. Situation. Ugh. 
Because there's a bunch of companies updating their terms of service and privacy policies right now. I don't know if there's like a, a six monthly audit or something that all these companies are going through. Or if there was some law change which kicks into effect right now in, in Europe, maybe. Good job with the, the cleaning. You got this. Can I? Oh, I bet I can. Oh, I can. All right. Good. Been deadly tastic. Glad it does. Alright, so I can do see what I've got in here where I've got like one ingredient in here. That's just going to end up being tossed. We'll see how that goes. So, don't know what we're doing tomorrow other than something. I don't know what we're doing on Saturday. Sunday, we're doing clothing store so for a little bit at least I have another couple of games that I could maybe throw in on Sunday just as a, a bit of a a hot pot of, of meals My hair is still bothering me. Cut it off. I'm gonna feel a lot better once I have a bunch of food put up.
Oh, that's a lot of wood. Lots of wood. I probably just need to put a crate on the floor. I still haven't decided how I want to design this kitchen. And now I know that I need to kind of be aware of spacing around some things. I'm like, is this really what I want to do? Like, I'm not worried about min-mixing in terms of efficiency. I just want automation. For kitchen appliances. Wait, where did all my pet go? Oh, it's in my inventory. Okay. Hey. The heck? Oh, there it is. Can I do this? Aha! I can. Red meat stew with boiled chopped chicken of the woods and chicken of the woods. <laughs> I love that goldfish one, it's so cute. So fancy. It goes there. It comes with me. It's over here. That's just gonna go off, so that's fine. Those are probably gonna go off too. Oh, there's spelt and right. right. Probably need to go and get some more grass for my cows too. Just a spot here, right? One, two, four. Will that do, do you reckon? When she, oh god. I 
One, two, three. Fuck. How do I do that? One, two, three, four, clear. Okay. Yeah. We're gonna add some more, some more light wells in there. thing at a time. One is it one eighty? Eight no, it's one sixty. Need another pick going because I'm paranoid about getting left without one. Oh. I need a backup, backup, okay? Extra backup. Well, ready. Look, why you gotta have cute emotes? <laughs> oh dear. Here, okay. I made mean, that make sense. It's been a perfectly normal, sane stream. As usual. Perfectly normal.
Okay, backup tools sorted. My my no oh my god, my nose has been so fucking itchy all day today. I cannot get over how bright the light is when it shines straight down. Like, glaring. Just them. Alright. It'll be fine. Okay, so are we going north of this bit Tomorrow, I need to pull my lawnmower back. I don't want to. It's because we have prehensile toes. Yes. One, two, three, four, here. Don't bring my glass. Oh, well. Yeah, I need my my lawnmower needs some tender love and care. I need to replace the carburetor and the gas tank, and I need to take the the bent blade off. He snuck outside with the dogs. What a cheeky shit. Honestly, that's kind of what Flint says when I like race him to candy. Like, oh, arthritis lady, still got the moves. I mean, doesn't. I'd probably thumb him if he said that. No. <laughs> Is he feeling pretty pleased with himself? Uh, 13 minutes. Ish. 14 minutes. Yeah, I was saying earlier, Flint's, uh, one of the outside cats, Squeaky, the boy cat, came in yesterday and his ears were like 
up and his tail was up and he was meowing up a storm the only time he ever does that is if he's bought his dad a gift um and we can't find it yeah we, we there's flies but we so as, assuming it's part of this mortal coil uh, but as to where it is i have no idea but the like he's he's kind of vocal but he's like he's really vocal when he's been hunting and he's feeling very pleased with himself so it's like oh oh good yeah it, he he tends to leave like half things like half squirrels yeah but that's a that's a flint job okay so we want to go west oh east of the one that we just did. It's like your cat bought you a gift. You deal with it. But yeah, Squeaky is so like he's he always comes in and he's so pleased with himself. Like you can tell he's like strutting and like showing off. And Flint always makes a big deal out of it too, like makes a fuss over him because it is helpful. It's just that occasionally he brings them inside and Flint's like, oh, cool, thanks. <laughs> I'm like, okay. No, my cat, your okay. cat. Okay. East of this one. It's so funny how they do that though, like with the body language and, you know, acting all tough, carrying around the toys and being like, I'm the shit. Like, look at me. So we're going ooh, right here. One, two, three. Or here. One, two, three. I'm putting the, the glass just so that I don't fall down these holes if I come up here. This has been so much diggy diggy hole today.
I have no idea what the level is inside the cave, so I don't know how close I am. I should probably look. I have a craving for water burger. Then I would have a whole lot of ammo to throw at myself and to, to eat myself. I did think of this. This is why I have a backup pack in my inventory. And chicken sandwiches, nice. Yeah, I have a, a, a backup pick with full stuff on it. See if that helps. I might as well do the last one. Oh, that's fine. This is a valid question. I don't know what it is, it's just something about the Whataburger sandwiches that I enjoy. I used to get put off because they were expensive, but then I realized that, you know, like one of those is actually filling as opposed to, you know, needing to get twice as many, no, what a burger. Um, like if you just went to like McDonald's or Burger King, you'd have to get, you know, a lot more to try and actually just fill out. One, two, four. Um, I don't, I don't know what the history is, but they do, um, I know, their chicken sandwiches are just really good. They usually have like a nice specialty shake too. We used to go to Steak and Shake a fair amount because Steak and Shake had these $4 meals that was like a burger and fries and they were pretty good. But then in the space of six months, they went from four dollars to to four dollars 44 because they were trying to stick with the sign and then they went up to five dollars something and i was like yeah no that's not a good deal that was my line there but i kind of miss them because steak and shake had like nice like garlicky buttery deliciousness going on How is it only nine o'clock? I genuinely thought I was going to end up starting stream later today. Yeah, I know, they just they they have good sandwiches. And they're open 24 hours, which is nice. So like if Flint and I have been been streaming late, it's convenient. Ow. All right, now we have an extra light source. I 
can't get rid of these, right? They've got to be anchored. Oh, no. Sweet. Just for the time being, I think I'm going to keep that there. <sighs> All right, so we've got some light coming down for the berries. I don't know if that's going to make any difference. I thought they were making progress, but I think it's probably too hot right now. Why they're not. I don't know if that's what's going on with the flags too. Some really differing times there. All right, Ravi, have a good lurk. I'm trying to decide if I want to do some like more gardens like back along here. I think that capo tree is still growing. Maybe. I think I'm just not giving everything enough time to grow. I'm getting impatient. Which I know is crazy, me getting impatient. I do know that these trees will get larger, like ones that I've planted. This one has it's oaks, so it'll get there. I wonder. I'm like, I could, I could just like chisel this and then get rid of the other one and then I'd have like invisible stepping stones. Appreciate you've hung out here enough to earn it, Mini.
damn it. Thank you. Now I need a bucket. Okay. Bucket. I have lost my bucket. Oh, wait, my bucket is over here. There's a hole in my pocket. There we are. So none of the hides from today will be gone to waste. What are doing there?
but it's absolutely that vlog. Why? Oh, there we go. I don't know why I feel the compulsion to have some sort of like super secret garden path across the lake. Chili man. Hi. Oh god, that's so much better. <laughs> it's so deep. I'm still vaguely hoping that maybe some salmon will spawn in here. They like, change the spawn conditions. Well, I have breakfast tomorrow. Well, I mean, it's it's natural for things to change. They will. We good.
You might find that you get hungry later on tonight. You'll wake up with the munchies. Oof, my, my hand's getting sore from it. No more random bubbles except for down here. I think actually we're gonna. Ow! But it. You should definitely. Get some. Play some vintage story. Ash! You'll have a tooting fantastic time. There, problem solved. Ah, uh, just it's just a block game. You you might have heard it heard of it. So so much shooting. Lots of granite stone from digging those light wells. It's great. Medium chunk of cassiter. I'm just like, uh, manual smith smithing. Right. 
fine. I can never remember which which container has what. I guess it's not doing itself. Right. Wait, where did the loom go? Yeah, there's there's a pretty wide range of of biomes. Um, you'll get to recognize them over time. There's like a couple of different like water grasses, uh, but sometimes they just don't spawn at all. That is pretty rude. It, I I frequently do that when I'm hungry. Okay, so I have seventeen blooms. Oh. So I need to. Have I wait? Have I got enough charcoal? That's a question. What is? I don't know what the temperature of the charcoal is. What temperature is required for iron? That was funny because my my husband's username on Twitch is Flint Gold. So when I'm hungry, I'm like Flint. I'll follow him around the house and make plaintive noises until he feeds me. Seven hundred. Oh, is that all? Feed me! Yeah, exactly. Like, I'm hungry! And he'd be like, we'll eat something then. And I'm like, but I don't want to cook. Like, your wife requires food. And he's like, then my wife can find some. So me. Not gonna do itself. Though, to be honest, I could. Yay! I could take a bunch of fuel and take my iron over to. Ape and Toast's place, and then use their health hammer. Oh. But that's even more effort.
that's not that's good and hot. I guess this isn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. Probably shouldn't have lit them both at the same time, but It would be easier with the hell of hammer, but this is bad. Oh, shit. I'm doing a Hicken Smith.
Not stop to eat now, game. Busy. Soon. Soon I will eat berries. Soon you will make baskets. It's so weird, like, cutting reeds is one of, like, my least favorite things to do in-game, and I don't know why. It's so different to anything else, but there's just something about it just seems... I don't know. I really don't know. Yeah, it's this is definitely a game that a lot of people like parallel play with. So you've got to be careful sometimes, especially if you're playing with aggressive critters. Because uh, the number of times where I've like heard a sound and assumed it was on someone else's stream, but it's actually behind me. Same with Project Zomboid. That's a that's a dangerous one to watch when someone else is playing. Oh, I didn't give myself much wiggle room there. Hi, hello, welcome to the channel. Thank you for the follow.
I guess this isn't so bad. I have to heat this one up again. Once I get the iron anvil, this will be better. Are we done yet?
I'm waiting for someone to come in and be like, did you know you can just use a howl hammer for this? And we're like, hmm. It's gotta go. I have no idea how many I've got now. I think I've only got to the Hell Hammer once before. I didn't really get there on the the uh blaster. I always forget about the heavy hits. While it's heating up, we we'll get some fruit. Because now I've done a bunch of cooking, I'm like, I bet I can't eat it. It would be weird. Go mine somewhere with that coal too.
my hammer! Ugh. I kind of forget about tool durability sometimes. Especially once you get a flint hopper. Sure. Gamifying things is a smart idea. If that if that gets the uh the endorphins working. Twenty six teens. Play a game for two minutes and pick something up twenty. That I mean, that sounds smart to be honest. And I don't think it Um I think it's a hundred percent a valid way. Like there's I've seen a lot of people who break things down it to a clock, so you know, they'll five minutes there, ten minutes there. And if whatever it works, you know, if you're getting things done and it works for you, then that's fantastic. Um, the, I see a lot of people, uh, who do body doubling streams will basically, like, they're using, uh, body doubling streams to get themselves to work better as well. So I'll see, like, they'll work for 25 minutes on stream, and then they'll chat for five minutes with whoever's in chat and then they'll work for 25 minutes and then chat again and it's like fuck if it works do it
I think you quite often will find like there will there's often channels in just chatting called like body doubling. But I I I appreciate that you feel comfy enough sharing that with me. And with chat. I will. I mean, is it? That's a leave-in. Oh shit, I did way more than I needed. I wanted to make sure I had enough for uh, making a an anvil. I have to make a hammer before I do anything else. My main issue with things is motivation. So I actually if I'm trying to do something, I cannot watch someone else because I will get distracted by whatever it is they're doing. I have to, like, if I'm going to be uh, working on something, I need, like, quiet and no distractions at all. Which was interesting. So when. Flint and I, we, we did like this online course together. Um, and he, he likes having background noise. And if I'm learning something, I need silence. When I'm cleaning, I can put on like a, a podcast or an audio book or something. Um, but it's... Yeah, I, I don't, I, as soon as I, there's like another person, I can't. Um, I, I get distracted and I'm off. <laughs> so if I've got like on Mondays, um, for instance, Um, I do like a, a big reset on Mondays rather than doing everything during the day. Like I do all my chores and stuff on Mondays, but the second I sit at my computer and start, like if I pop into a stream, that's it. My day is fucked on a Monday. I've got to make sure the second I get out of bed, I start doing things uh, or, or I'm done for. Oh, I don't mind, because it. The main thing is, as long as I get things done, I'm happy. So I'd rather get up, get shit done, <clears throat> and I'll just keep going until I'm like fucking miserable. 
Um, and then... I'm good, you know? But I also hate being interrupted, so if I have plans for... Um... Work. Um, if I have plans for like cleaning for instance on a Monday and then I find out last minute that I'm going to do something else it it really throws me off and I get really fucking grumpy <laughs> oh that's 160 I just I hate it Like, I have my routine and I need it to be what it is. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I'm really, really possessive over my own time. I also absolutely loathe people just turning up to my house. I will pretend to not be home if someone turns up at my house. Um, like, I will just not open my door. In fact, I'm so bad at that. Back at, when I was back in New Zealand, um, a good friend of mine was going on a big overseas trip. Like, I knew he was planning on traveling overseas and probably wasn't coming back. He was a really good friend. Um, and he, he came by my house to say goodbye, but he didn't call to tell me or to ask first. I saw his car turn up and I froze and then I hid in the bathroom until he left. And I never saw him again. So, Stephen, if you're out there, I'm, I'm sorry. I just... I have to have control of these things. So, yeah, last, last one of plans. Oh yeah, like he he knew what I was like. I'm I'm not like cut up about it. He was I'm sure he knew exactly where I was cuz he knew what I was like. So he probably was aware that that was a risk he he was facing turning up when he did. Um But yeah, I've I've had like I had an uncle turn up at my house and he's like I know you're there and I just went quiet and like I'm not answering the door. Like, I could see you are there. Nope. <laughs> nope. Fuck off. I would genuinely be tempted to be like, no, you can't. Oh. Oh, we have ad starting in thirty seconds, by the way. Exactly. Okay. Oh, is that it?
photo. It's such a poo. It's still picture in picture for some people. I think. Right. <laughs> Very good. Do I, uh, do I want to do... Do I want to do this? I don't, I don't know if that'll work, will it? Oh, it will. I don't know if you could heat up multiple ones at the same time. watering can would work but yeah i i'm i'm pretty bad about <sighs> unplanned changes um and it'll throw me for a loop every time unless i'm expecting unplanned changes which is why i'm okay with saturdays when i never know from one day to the next if we're going to be doing trucks or not. That's totally fine. It's even 140 degrees. Uh... Why am I doing this? This is not what I wanted to do. Oh god.
All right, well, that wasn't what I wanted to do, but... What I want is that. I just did this like the dumbest way.
I really wasn't smart about this. up to guys i welcome in everyone hope you had a lovely stream are you working on uh your magic mod that's what i thought that's awesome very cool coming along all right Why did I decide to do this? It was like the most Angel thing. Ooh, that sounds exciting. I don't know what it means, but it sounds exciting. We making an anvil. Yeah, the, uh, the the first iron anvil, and it is such a delight. I forgot how exciting this process is. But we're getting there. Why are you going that way? With one voxel to spare. Ah, hey.
I'm like, do I, do I have the energy requires? Welcome in, by the way. I'm sorry. I'm like super focused, uh, but welcome in. Thank you for the raid. Um, hi, I'm Del, Deloria. My, my pronouns are she, her, and I'm, oh, I am bullying myself into making my iron anvil. Because I've been putting it off for a really long time. <laughs> Yeah, basically 84 years. Yeah. And because I accidentally made that health hammerhead, I have exactly 10 ingots here. I think I should be okay though. Oh. Um, uh, you know, I should probably... Oh, I've got the considerate still. Just in case this hammer doesn't last. with like a fuckload of picks but you know they get used anyway just want to get all the iron anvil done i have the borax i need for it here here all right while that's heating up let's go and have a look at the garden well how are we doing? Much better. How about my berries? And it's too hot for turnips right now. It's too hot for the berries too. That's okay. Oh, wait, that's down, huh? That way. Fresh for a hundred sixty six days. I don't know how many ingots I need for the head, but I'd rather have too many than not enough heated up. Hmm. 
really hoping that tree gets taller. I think it will. This iron halipemi, and I've got a, a mold for one going too, but I guess I don't really need this because I just made that anyway. What's the temperature in iron? 741. Wait, what are you doing? Fuck me. Alright. I've just... Good. Well, not really, but... I'm desperately hoping I don't get someone trying to backseat on how to do this because I will not take it well. So it's like the dumbest place to put them to. Okay. <clears throat> I think the last time I did this, I had the anvil up like on a pedestal and it just made it so much easier if I could like walk around it Yeah, no, I've I've done this before. I was just <laughs> no braining it. Um, but thank you for asking. I appreciate it. But yeah. I just put everything down in a silly place. Didn't do thing.
Or I'm just gonna try and fill it in by layer now. And we'll get there eventually. What I did last time is I literally just did like one ingot at a time. On time before that was a bit chaotic. I just kind of dumped everything in a pile and did a whole lot of heavy hits. I think we're getting there. It's not hot enough, but... There. Did you tell me to eat my veggies? Ew! Oh, they gross! Why would you say that? Yo, uh... I like broccoli. You, uh... David... I do like veggies. It's just that we don't eat them very often. I still can't really tell what's going on here. Oh well, it's fine. Uh, you know, oh, oh, there, in the air, please.
Okay, I have a spear. All right. I hate that I didn't think about what I was doing before I started this. Alright. Get all this compacted. there I had it all filled in what the fuck okay did I just do something really dumb then or what Because this was like all filled in and now it's not. I'll just get back on that. I think something funky went on there. At least it flipped, maybe. Which doesn't seem likely. Yeah, it it's like 
it all resets. I don't know what the fuck happened there. It's so frustrating. <laughs> Especially because I'm really fucking tired and I was like, right, we'll do this. Get it done. And then I can go eat. All right, I think, I think I'm just gonna leave it <laughs> and come back tomorrow um, because I'm irritable now. Um, so uh, I'm gonna send you over to my friend Pote and uh, um, Pote is playing, I don't know what Pote is playing, Kingdom Hearts or something? Um, I'll be back on tomorrow from around 4 p.m. Easternish uh, with some more of this. We get this fucking anvil sorted out. Um, here are the raid messages if you would like to copy and paste. Um, ah. It's not letting me, not letting me do it. Here we go. Um, and that's my link to social if you want to follow me there. And I'm starving, so I'm just gonna go have fun. Bye!